All right, afternoon all. I am off to Greithwaite later today. Just working from home. I'm going to set off about four o'clock. Um, I actually fancy making a video this weekend as well, so hopefully I'll manage to pull a load of clips together. The last race one from Scotland was pretty crap, really, because it was just loads of riding, and the stages were really long, and yeah. So I think I'm going to tweak the format up and actually try and do a bit more of a vlog covering the whole weekend. I'll edit that and just put tiny bits of riding in, that bits that look interesting to me. And then I'll just upload the whole runs in case anyone wants to see them on their own. I think that'll be the plan. But yeah, I'm buzzing. <coughs> Excuse me. But yeah, I'm buzzing for this weekend. It should be good fun. The uh, trails look really good seen a few pictures, I've never been there before so I'm excited for that and I've never done a PMBA race as well, one of Kev's and they're always meant to be good lots of off camber loose and uh, loamy stuff, it looks good, hopefully the weather will hold out Why is the M6 always so crap whenever I need to go on it? Hopefully it's not too far but so frustrating I've only been going 40 minutes, if that. No, I mean, yeah. Anyway. All right, we're about 10 minutes away, so. What time is it? Quarter to eight, set off at 10 to four. Yeah, shouldn't have taken that long, but it's bank holiday, fri well, Friday of a bank holiday weekend, so M6 is always gonna be crap, so need to get the tent up as soon as possible, and get some food. Get in there, tent up, bed up in about half an hour. Not too bad, it's still light. Morning all, it's about half six. It was pretty cold again last night. I don't know if I'm doing camping wrong, but I've got like two sleeping bags on top of that camp bed thing. But yeah, I get cold, man. I've got thermals on and everything. Anyways, this is my setup. I've got a little 70 quid uh, decathlon tent and a uh, bit of camping gear, table, chair. Yeah, does me. Good old hike up to one, come back up into two and seven. Stage one's here.
e-bike what are we on now stage four bit of an inside there if you want it this is nice the others have been so fiddly Can they jump that? Yeah, fine, but it's that bit's catching everybody out. You've probably just done everybody a massive favour because you've just loosened it up. <laughs> well, there's a tiny little uh, rock, and you can like pop up it, but yeah. then it just lands you on the route. Yeah, boy. Oh. Yeah, boy. <laughs> Fucking hard to drop in though, so many people here now. No. Fitness. No, no, no. 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 Slow down! Yeah, it's the line, James, anyway. I've yeah. been down it, definitely. A break. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You got it, you got it.
Back, had a shower, I think it's about four o'clock. That was a pretty big day actually. It's only a 15 mile loop, but there was a lot of hiker bike, pretty much. Five, six of the stages, you pretty much have to push up and they're not even an easy push, so yeah. Legs are pretty pooped. Stages are good fun, super fiddly and difficult really. So yeah, it's good though. So I'm not gonna take the camera tomorrow because I have to have the helmet really tight to stop it rocking back and forth on my head and then it's too tight and pinching and it's not comfortable so it just puts me off so yeah hopefully we've got a bit of footage today I wasn't really going super fast but here's what it is so yeah I'll let you know how I get on anyway morning I'm just editing the Greithwaite video and it got to the end and spotted I never actually kind of updated you I just was in the tent and just said I'd let you know how I get on because I didn't take the camera on race day because it was bouncing around on my head too much on the helmet it was uncomfortable so race day actually went pretty well um, I got through all eight stages clean there was a one stage where there was a hard and a easy chicken line and I randomly ended up on the chicken line and went the wrong way there so lost a bit of time and a few little line choices that were wrong but they cost me not a lot and where I sit in the field it doesn't really make a huge amount of difference so I was just glad to get through the weekend having fun and riding eight stage eight stages pretty clean so just got roots and rain up because I forgot because it's about two or three weeks back and I was 78th out of 183 in masters so just over halfway up the table which I'm yeah pretty pleased with so that was good um, I think the video looks better as well I've just edited it um, and yeah it's a lot I enjoyed watching it back and like the other one so that's good um, yeah subscribe if you want to see the next one this weekend I'm off to Minehead for round 3 of the national series so that would be good and I think I've got a Canic video with a few clips on the camera which I'm going to get off now so yeah see you at the next one